This is a response to the channel Outdoor Christian Boy, in which I subscribe to from Red State No Weight. I just wanted to show you probably one of my favorite knives that I have, an EDC knife. And the contest and the video response contest was to enter and tell what your favorite knife was and to give an experience that you have with your father figure from the outdoors. And when I was growing up, my dad passed away when I was younger and my granddad stepped in and he played a big part of the role in my life, uh, taught me a lot. And one of the things that he taught me to do was to whittle when I was a kid. And even though this isn't necessarily representative of a knife that you would whittle with, uh, he taught me a lot about knives. And I never forget when he taught me to sharpen a knife in the way that he taught me to sharpen one. Um, the way that he always sharpened it was he would take it to the stone. And I don't have a sharpened stone, but I have this stone here with me. To keep it on my desk. It's a paperweight. And he would show me to make little circular motions, and that's how he would sharpen his knife. I never did think that that would work that well until I learned what he was doing in that. And it actually is a very quick way that you can sharpen a knife. I mean, if you don't care about the profile and the blade, and you just need an edge on your blade really quick, you can sharpen a knife really fast that way. And uh, some of the older knives, especially carbon steel knives that I used to have, uh, I used to do that with. This particular knife is a... Kershaw oh so sweet assisted opening it also has the flipper design very fast spring assist opening uh, it's probably my favorite EDC knife that I've ever had um, I bought this I think off of Amazon uh, for about twenty dollars it's been an excellent knife it's glass filled handles uh, it's got a AUS 8 steel they also come in an 8CR13MOV still as well. Uh, very rust resistant. Uh, just a, an excellent all around knife. Thank you very much. Appreciate your time. And I hope your contest goes well.